Um, there's a light on. Okay, hello, testing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. This is a test, this is a test. We're at Anne Marie Perry's house and we're jamming out with some green bracelet and Michael K. Peace. Johnny. Patty. Oh, Grant. 24. Love that, Michael. Yuck it! Come on! Where are we? Oh, Anne Marie's basement. <laughs> Anne Marie's basement. Live from Anne Marie's basement. It's Michael <laughs> K. This was written about a woman who I was very deeply in love with. It's called People Are Defective. <laughs> People are defective. <laughs> People are defective. They maybe weren't born that way, but by the time you meet them and try to fall in love with them, they are defective. <laughs> they are defective. You don't notice it at first. At first you're taken in by a twinkle in her eye or by the way that she laughs or by something that lets you know that this is no ordinary woman. No ordinary woman. The next thing you know, she is telling you what an asshole her ex-husband is. How she doesn't have car insurance and how she is thinking about killing herself. People are defective! People are defective! People are defective! <laughs> are you defective? Yes, sir. absolutely. A room full of yeses. Yes, sir. <laughs> this is also written about someone I love. It's called Show Me the Stars. There's nothing to come the fear of a day full of creditors who can't be satisfied, dunning letters that can't be replied to, except for a walk in the dark to the store for ice cream with a dog to see... With a dog... He killed me with the laugh, man. With a dog <laughs> happy to see me and a daughter who brings the flashlight to show me the stars. I'm a long way out of the bars, you know, 22 years without drinks, so it's like the heckle or the short heckle just throws me like, I'm used to reading this to my girlfriend in my bedroom now, you know, I'm a superstar at home. I didn't really, I didn't really want to make it, you know, all those pressures of money and fame, I, I don't need it, you know, I'm, I'm happy taking out the trash. Hey, do you, do you need a drum roll? Defective. I need a whole band, motherfucker. This is called You Are Beautiful, and I'll dedicate it to Joan. <laughs> you are beautiful as you are, wherever you are, however you are. If the sun is shining, if the moon is out, upon waking and before you fall asleep. You are beautiful when you are pouting, you are beautiful when you smile, you are beautiful when you are here, you are beautiful when you are there. You are a beautiful person. You are beautiful on the telephone, you are beautiful here, you are beautiful there. I'm glad that you are here with me, Joan. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a place to sleep tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Only if you make up the bed. Is that like a form oh, letter? I told you to make the bed before we left. It's in my contract. I'm a poet. I don't make beds, okay? <laughs> This is called the women, the a, a woman who I can't put down. I still got the woman on my mind. I mean, come on, John, what's going on here? <laughs> a woman who I can't put down. Books bore me. Women bore me. Okay, most books bore me. Most women bore me. I'm looking for a book that I have to read from cover to cover. I'm looking for a woman who I can't put down. And I found her. Oh. Joan. <laughs> there's, there's breakfast in bed. <laughs> We're going to get close to the Dear light <laughs> and For all you political people, this is called Someday I Will Start the Revolution. I'm there. I'm yeah, starting baby. the revolution already. Yeah, what do you Bring think it. I was trying to do? <laughs> the government is watching. <laughs> Someday I will start the revolution, but this morning I had to bring cleats and a baseball uniform to my son. Someday I'll start the revolution, but for right now, there is cereal to buy and Nintendo games to rent. Someday I'll start the revolution, but my son's sneakers are worn and he needs new clothes for the spring. Someday I will start the revolution, but my daughter needs a new dress, and I've got to come up with the money for her next guitar lesson. Someday I will start the revolution, but I've got to get those student loans paid off and these credit cards paid down. Someday I will start the revolution. But I just got this new apartment, and the cable hasn't even been put in. <laughs> Someday I will start the revolution. But I need my manifesto. 
I'm like, I spin over again. I'm like, <laughs> I did like a stage thing. I'm like, yeah. working the microphone. <laughs> Someday I will start the revolution, but I need new tires for my car. Someday I'll start the revolution, but I may want to get a master's in poetry or creative writing first. Can you tell I need them? Yes, Someday I will start the revolution, but but this woman just walked by and man does she look good. <laughs> Someday I will start the revolution. Yeah. <laughs> I think that's good enough. Thank you all. Oh, one more. One more. One more. I don't know which is hers and which is mine now, and I'm frustrated well, about it. <laughs> I just want to rip it all and throw it all apart. Her no. new songs and everything. No, 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 no. We're going to write together, so it doesn't matter. Just keep that. Okay. That's my first I submission. Know, with the gem. Gem. Cool. 50 50. You're all witnesses, okay? 50-50. Okay. <laughs> I'm going to write melody, and he's going to throw lyrics on top that y'all are going to go, oh. And we're both going to get paid. Yeah. Yay. 50 we're going to call it Black Flag. <laughs> yeah. <laughs>